Hi, this is Sahal. This is a message for people who are working in the software industry. In software industry, things change very fast. The things that you have learned a year ago might not be valuable now. I've been reading and watching videos about a lot of where the software industry is going to head in the next five to 10 years. And in my understanding, with this new AI thing, there is going to be a drastic change in the way we write code. And the entire industry is going to have a paradigm shift. And the reason why I'm saying is, until now, the way the software is written is in such a way that there is a place where we store the data, store the information, and then there are some ways we fetch those data and the entire industry is built around this. So the front end, back end, APIs, Kubernetes, clusters, deployment, all those things are built around this data, built around this concept of storing and fetching data. Now that is changing. With the arrival of AI, instead of fetching information, now we are going to generate information. The concept of storing doesn't make sense. I mean, storing does make sense, but the concept of having an API to fetch the data is no longer a thing now. Now we teach the AI something. We have an ML model, we have an AI model and we give it some data and then it generates the data for us. And we are going to see something in the likes of AI model as a service. So we, have, we used to have infrastructure as a service, software as a service, platform as a service. Now we are going to have something called AI model as a service. And look at the way how we write code now. A major chunk of code is written in the front end of the software where user are interacting with it. Why are the user interacting? It is to get some information, right? So if, if you want to book a flight, what you are doing is you are using the user interface to book a flight, right? What if you don't have to do that? Instead, it's a chat box. Everything is going to be a chat, I think. You just type, I want to book this, this from here to here. And it, it will list out some, or maybe it will tell you some. And then you can just say what you want. So the entire concept of friend end being there is there is no friend end work over there. It's just a chat interface. I mean, this is not to scare or this is not to spread fear, but I want to give you the awareness that nothing stays the way it is, right? There was a time where working in a manufacturing plant where we used to weave dresses was supposed to be a thing. And then in, with industrialization, all those things got automated. So you should always align yourself in such a way that you are in the right side of the technology. So keep that in mind when you are going to study something or when you are going to start a new course or when you are trying to figure out what you want to do in life. This doesn't mean that all the jobs are not going to be there lots of new work will come up and there will be a lot of opportunity to contribute into it. You just have to have a learning mindset and be curious. Don't be rigid in the sense that I am this engineer or I am a backend engineer or a front end engineer or I'm a software engineer, a mechanical engineer. Don't be rigid in, in what you are. Don't be rigid in your identity. Be flexible, have a learning mindset. If you have that, you are good to go. Then you don't have any problem because things are changing really, really fast. I just want to put that out there. If you have already thought about it, or if you want to chat more about it, DM me. Let's have a discussion and try to figure out how we can learn things together. You cannot predict anything, but you could have a vague idea of where it could be, right? So yeah, DM me if you like to talk about this more. That's all. Stay curious, follow me. Follow, like, share, subscribe.